I want to welcome everybody to the Grand Commerce Prairie 20th, 21st, 22nd, and 25th Street Infrastructure Improvements Design Meeting. This meeting is being recorded. If you can see the screen, please post your questions in the chat. That's at the bottom right hand of your screen. When the presentation is done, we will answer those chat questions first. Then we will take questions from call-in users one at a time. Buenas tardes y bienvenidos a la reunión de diseño de reparos de infraestructura de Grand Commerce Prairie 20th, 21st, 22nd y 25th Street. Esta presentación empezará a las 6.05. Um, publique preguntas en el chat. Cuando termine la presentación, las responderemos primero. Luego responderemos las preguntas de los usuarios que llamen, uno a la vez. Esta presentación se está grabando. Sally, would you like for me to go through the agenda? Uh, um, before, before Sally responds, this is Council Member Flores. Uh, can we uh, do a quick roll call? Just a you know brief intro of who's online. Okay, I'm Sally Ellerton. I'm Project Communications for Water Capital Delivery. Um, I'm Susie Abbey. I'm the project manager with Capital Delivery. I'm Tony Shalola, assistant director, uh, Capital Delivery, Water Department. This is Sarath Paydar, project control specialist with the City of Fort Worth Water Department. Martina Salinas with the City of Fort Worth Water Department, also a project control scheduler. Um, Aaron Garcia, Northside Neighborhood Association President. Carlos Flores, uh, City Council Member, District 2. Uh, as I said earlier, uh, let's see, we have uh, also Maria Gallegos. I don't know if uh, she's my district director. I don't know if she's uh, uh, is muted or listening in. Myra, you there? Yes, sir. Yes, it's okay. Myra. <laughs> okay, great. Thank you for being here. And, and again, as I previously said, I don't know if any member of the Diamond Hill Neighborhood Association uh, has been able to log in. Do we have any, any representative of the Diamond Hill Neighborhood Association online? Okay, well, it appears not. So uh, staff, returning to you. Okay, I guess I was muted. Uh, the agenda for tonight's meeting is your introductions, which uh, Councilmember Flores just did for us. Uh, we'll do a project overview. We will show you the project area, and then we will do frequently asked questions. La agenda para esta presentación. Ya hicimos las introducciones. Vamos a describir el proyecto, el área del proyecto, y preguntas frecuentes. Okay, and we already did, uh, introduced the design team. We've got Susie Abbey as our project manager. If you have questions, her phone number is 817-392-8209. Her email is Suzanne, S-U-Z-A-N-N-E dot Abbey, A-B-B-E -B -B -E, at FortWorthTexas.gov. Our engineering design consultant is Pape Dawson Engineers, and they are represented by Randy Haney. And tonight, Myra will be doing the translation for this meeting. And of course, Councilmember Flores is also here. Su equipo de proyecto de diseño incluye gerente de proyecto Susie Abbey. Si tiene cualquier pregunta, puede hablarle al 817-392-8209 o mandarle un correo electrónico a susan.abby.fortworthtexas. Punto GOV. Consultor de diseño de ingeniería, Kate Dawson Engineers, es Randy Haney. Okay. 
I was on mute too. Um, so for a project overview, sanitary sewer mains and water mains will be replaced in an area bound by Northwest 25th Street to the north, North Grove Street to the east, Northwest 16th Street and Northeast 14th Street to the south and Grand Avenue to the west. Landmarks include the Stockyard Station, Saunders Park, MG Ellis Primary School, Marine Park, Northside Park, JP Elder Middle School, and Maddox Park. This project is in City Council District 2 and impacts the Northside Neighborhood Association and the Inter District 2 Alliance. Descripción del proyecto. Las tuberías principales de drenaje sanitario y de agua serán reemplazadas en un área delimitada por Northwest 25th Street al norte, North Grove Street al este, Northwest 16th Street y Northeast 14th Street al sur y Grand Avenue al oeste. Los lugares de interés incluyen Stockyard Station, Sanders Park, MG Ellis Primary School, Marine Park, Northside Park, JP Elder Middle School y Maddox Park. Este proyecto se encuentra en el Distrito 2 del Consejo Municipal e impacta a la Asociación de Vecindarios de Northside y la Alianza Interdistrita 2. Zooming into the uh, zooming into the affected project uh, streets, we have water and sewer replacement on Prairie Avenue from Northwest 21st Street to Northwest 22nd Street. Viendo en detalle el mapa, estas son las carreteras que van a tener proyectos. Prairie Avenue desde Northwest 21st Street hasta Northwest 22nd Street. Agua y drenaje. On Northwest 22nd Street from Prairie Avenue to Loving Avenue, we're replacing water and sewer. En Northwest 22nd Street, desde Prairie Avenue hasta Loving Avenue, van a reemplazar agua y drenaje. Sewer will be replaced in the alley between Chestnut Avenue and Pearl Avenue from Northwest 23rd Street to Northwest 24th Street. Drenaje será reemplazada en el callejón entre Chestnut Avenue y Pearl Avenue desde Northwest 23rd Street hasta Northwest 24th Street. Sewer will be replaced along Northwest 21st Street from the alley between Columbus Avenue and Chestnut Avenue to the alley between Pearl Avenue and Market Avenue. Reemplazarán drenaje en Northwest 21st Street desde el callejón entre Columbus Avenue y Chestnut Avenue hasta el callejón entre Pearl Avenue y Market Avenue. Along Grand Avenue from Northwest 19th Street to 425 feet Northwest, uh, water and sewer will be replaced. Reemplazarán agua y drenaje en Grand Avenue desde Northwest 19th Street hasta 425 pies al noroeste. In the alley between Grand Avenue and Highland Avenue from Northwest 18th Street, to 440 feet northwest, sewer is being replaced. Reemplazarán drenaje en el callejón entre Grand Avenue y Highland Avenue, desde Northwest 18th Street hasta 440 pies al noroeste. Sewer will be replaced in the alley between Homan Avenue and Harrington Avenue from the alley north and parallel to Park Street to 625 feet northwest. Reemplazarán drenaje en el callejón entre Homan Avenue y Harrington Avenue, desde el callejón norte y paralelo al Park Street hasta 625 pies noroeste. In the alley between Harrington Avenue and Lagonda Avenue, from 100 feet from the alley north and parallel to Northwest 16th Street, to 165 feet northwest, sewer is being replaced. Reemplazarán drenaje en el callejón entre Harrington Avenue y Langonda Avenue desde 100 pies 
desde el callejón norte y paralelo al Northwest 16th Street hasta 165 pies noroeste. Along Northwest 20th Street, from the alley between Ellis Avenue and North Main Street to the dead end, sewer is being replaced. Otro mapa viendo en detalle, Northwest 20th Street, desde el callejón entre Ellis Avenue y North Main Street hasta el callejón sin salida, reemplazarán drenaje. Sewers being replaced along in the alley east of North Main Street from Northeast 20th Street to 50 feet southeast. Reemplazarán drenaje en el callejón al este de North Main Street desde Northeast 20th Street hasta 50 pies al suroeste. Sewers being replaced in the alley between Main Street and North Commerce Street from Northeast 20th Street to Northeast 21st Street. Reemplazarán drenaje en el callejón entre Main Street y North Commerce Street, desde Northeast 20th Street hasta Northeast 21st Street. Water and sewer are both being replaced along North Commerce Street from Northeast 20th Street to Northeast 21st. Se reemplazará agua y drenaje en North Commerce Street desde Northeast 20th Street hasta Northeast 21st Street. Sewer is being replaced along Northeast 21st Street from North Grove to 180 feet west. Reemplazarán drenaje en Northeast 21st Street desde North Grove Street hasta 180 pies al oeste. Sewer is being replaced in the alley between North Commerce Street and North Calhoun Street from Northeast 23rd to 700 feet, to, to 700 feet south. Reemplazarán drenaje en el callejón entre North Carmer Street y North Calhoun Street, desde Northeast 23rd Street hasta 700 pies al sur. And in an easement east of Main Street from Northeast 23rd to 150 feet north, sewer is being replaced. Reemplazarán drenaje servidumbre al este de Main Street desde Northeast 23rd Street hasta 150 pies al norte. Sewer is being replaced in Northwest 25th Street from Prospect Avenue to 200 feet west. Viendo más en detalle otra área donde va a haber reemplazamientos, Northwest 25th Street, desde Prospect Avenue hasta 200 pies al oeste, reemplazarán drenaje. In the alley between Lee Avenue and Ross Avenue, from Northwest 25th to 360 feet south, sewer is being replaced. Se reemplazará drenaje en el callejón entre Lee Avenue y Ross Avenue. Desde Northwest 21st Street hasta 360 pies al sur. Sewers being replaced in the alley between Lee Avenue and Ross Avenue from Northwest 23rd Street to Northwest 24th Street. Reemplazarán drenaje en el callejón entre Lee Avenue y Ross Avenue desde Northwest 23rd Street hasta Northwest 24th Street. And water and sewer are both being replaced in Ross Avenue from Northwest 24th Street and 250 feet north. Reemplazarán agua y guada drenaje en Ross Avenue desde Northwest 24th Street y 250 pies al norte. Uh, in the alley between Clinton Avenue and North Houston Street from Northwest 23rd to 530 feet north, sewer is being replaced. Se reemplazará el drenaje en el callejón entre Clinton Avenue y North Houston Street desde Northwest 23rd Street hasta 530 pies al norte. In the alley between North Houston Street and Ellis Avenue from West Exchange Avenue to 500 feet south, uh, we're replacing the sewer. Reemplazará el drenaje en el callejón entre North Houston Street y Ellis Avenue 
desde West Exchange Avenue hasta 500 pies al sur. So some frequently asked questions. Why are you doing this project? Fort Worth prioritizes water and sewer line replacements based on available data, which includes the water main break history, leak history, CCTV, closed circuit TV, um, age of the line, line material, and whether there are lead service lines. In this instance, the project was created to replace aging water and sewer lines. Most of the replacements are for pipes installed between 1909 and 1927, and there are lead service lines that will be replaced as part of this project. Una pregunta común es por qué están haciendo este proyecto. Fort Worth prioriza los reemplazos de líneas de agua y drenaje según los datos disponibles que incluyen el historial de roturas de la tubería principal de agua, el historial de fugas, la inspección de CCTV, circuito cerrado de TV, la antigüedad de la línea, el material de la línea y si hay líneas de servicio de plomo. En este caso, el proyecto se creó para reemplazar las viejas líneas de agua y drenaje. La mayoría de los reemplazos son para tuberías instaladas entre 1909 y 1927. Hay líneas de servicio de plomo que serán reemplazadas como parte de este proyecto. What streets will have construction in the streets? Prairie Avenue, Northwest 25th Street, Northwest 22nd Street, Northwest 21st Street, Northeast 20th, uh, Northeast 21st Street, Northwest 20th Street, Grand Avenue, North Commerce, and Ross Avenue. Las carreteras que acaba de mencionar son las calles que tendrán construcción. Will you need access to our property? If an easement is needed, you should have been or will be notified if your property is one that requires access. Will our sewer service be disrupted? Sanitary sewer service will not be interrupted. New sewer cleanouts will be installed at the property line. The sewer cleanout provides crews easy access if a backup or blockage occurs. Otra pregunta común es si necesitará acceso a nuestra propiedad. Si, es, si se necesita acceso, se le debería haber notificado o se le, se le notificará si su propiedad requiere acceso. Otra pregunta es, ¿se interrumpirá nuestro servicio de drenaje? No se interrumpirá el servicio de drenaje sanitario. Se instalarán nuevas limpiezas de drenaje en el límite de la propiedad. La limpieza del drenaje proporciona a las cuadrillas un fácil acceso si se produce un atasco o un bloqueo. Will our water be turned off? Water will be turned off for 15 to 30 minutes when service is transferred from the existing line to a temporary water line and when the service is transferred from the temporary to the new line. ¿Se apagará nuestra agua? Es otra pregunta común. El agua se cortará durante 15 a 30 minutos cuando el servicio se transfiera de la línea existente a una línea de agua temporal y cuando el servicio se transfiera de la línea temporal a la nueva. What happens if my property is damaged? The contractor will take pictures and video of the property before breaking ground. We also encourage property owners to take pictures and video of their property before construction starts. The contractor will restore the property to its original condition. Will the construction affect my irrigation? The contractor will ask property owners to turn on the irrigation system so sprinkler heads can be located and flagged. The contractor has to cap irrigation lines before construction starts. The contractor will replace capped or damaged irrigation systems. Otras preguntas son, ¿qué pasa si mi propiedad se daña? El contratista tomará fotografías y videos de la propiedad antes de comenzar la construcción. También le sugerimos a los propietarios 
a que tomen fotografías y videos de su propiedad antes de que comience la construcción. El contratista restaurará la propiedad a su condición original. Otra pregunta es si la construcción afectará mi sistema de, de riego. El contratista pedirá a los propietarios que enciendan el sistema de riego para poder ubicar y marcar los, cabe, los cabezales de los rociadores. El contratista debe tapar las líneas de riego antes de que comience la construcción. El contratista reemplazará los sistemas de riego tapados o dañados durante la construcción. As for a timeline for the project, this is a design meeting. The next steps will be advertising for bids for construction, opening bids, city council approval to award the bid to the contractor, a pre-construction meeting with the contractor and the inspection and the inspector, a WebEx community construction meeting to update those impacted by the project, and then construction begins. La cronología de este proyecto. Esta es una reunión de diseño. Los siguientes pasos incluyen publicidad de licitaciones para la construcción, ofertas de apertura, aprobación del ayuntamiento para adjudicar la oferta al contratista, reunión previa a la construcción con el contratista y el inspector, una reunión de construcción de la comunidad de WebEx para actualizar a los afectados por el proyecto. Después de estos pasos, empezará la construcción. Where can I get more information? Progress will be updated on the City of Fort Worth website at the following link. You can also go to www.fortworthtexas.gov and put in the project number 2719 in the search bar on the homepage. The link to this meeting video, the project map, and the project summary and frequently asked questions will be linked to this project page. ¿Dónde puedo obtener más información? El progreso se actualizará en el sitio web de la ciudad de Fort Worth en el link incluido. También puede ir a www.fortworthtexas.gov y poner el número del proyecto. 2719 en la barra de búsqueda de la página de inicio. El enlace o el link a este video, este video que está siendo grabado, el mapa del proyecto y el resumen del proyecto. Otras preguntas frecuentes estarán vinculadas a esta página del proyecto. Uh, contacts, if you need additional information, you can reach out to me, project manager, uh, Susie Abbey at 817-392-8209, or you can also email me at suzanne.abby at fortworthtexas.gov. Si tiene cualquier pregunta, puede contactarse con la gerente de proyecto, Suzanne Abbey, al 817-392-8209. O mandar un correo electrónico a susan.abby.fortworthtexas.gov. How do I report an emergency or non-emergency? Emergencies like water main breaks, sewer backups can be reported 24 hours a day at 817-392-4477. Select option one. You can also reach the water call center for non-emergencies from 7 a.m. to 7 p.m. Monday through Friday at 817-392-4477. But they are closed on city holidays. You can download the My Fort Worth app from the App Store or Google Play. You can report sewer overflows, leaks, and water main breaks missing or broken meter lids, water theft, water violations, no water service, water pressure issues, and other sewer concerns. ¿Cómo puedo reportar una emergencia o otro problema? 
para emergencias de roturas de tuberías de agua, reflujos de drenaje. A las 24 horas al día puede llamar al 817-392-4477 y seleccione la opción número 1. Centro de llamadas de agua que no sea de emergencia. Puede marcar de lunes a viernes de 7 de la mañana a 7 de la tarde al 817-392-4477, pero sí están cerrados en días festivos. También puede descargar la aplicación My Fort Worth en el App Store o Google Play. Puede informar sobre desbordamientos de drenaje, fugas y roturas en la tubería principal de agua, tapas de medidores rotas o faltantes, robo de agua, infracciones de agua, falta de servicio de agua, problemas de presión de agua y otros problemas de drenaje. Well, this concludes our presentation. Um, are there any questions in the chat? We don't have any questions in chat. Do, does anybody have a question for Suzanne? I don't have any questions, but I'm going to defer to um, Mr. Garcia. Hey, Jay. Uh, yes, uh, as of now, no, I mean, I guess we'll wait for the next meeting. It would have just been time frame when I can let the members know, but um, I guess we'll just follow up with this and stay on top of it and see when it comes out with a time frame. So, and see if the members have any questions uh, for the next meeting. Okay, there's also uh, a link on the city's uh, uh, website. Uh, we'll share that with you, AJ, so that way it's easier to uh, to access some of that information that was shared today. Okay. Uh, you know, for my own purposes, staff, uh, Sally, uh, could I get sent the uh, PowerPoint that was presented here uh, this evening? Could I get that emailed? Sure. Yes, okay. and then the link, um, it becomes a YouTube video. So the YouTube video link of this meeting will be on the project page, I hope, by Thursday night. Okay. Got it. Okay. Well, I'll be looking for that. Thank you. Thank you. Anybody else? Okay. Thank you all for joining us. Okay. Appreciate staff. Thank you again, AJ, for attending. Yes, thank you. All right. Bye-bye. And thanks for translating, Myra. You're welcome, sir.